guys, I'm Rydell. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys all had such an amazing holiday. I wanted to just share with you guys what I got for Christmas because I like watching those kind of videos and I know that you guys probably do too. So I just got a couple of things here and I'm gonna walk you through them right now. Okay, so we did a secret Santa with in our family, the seven of us, me, my four brothers, and my mom and dad. And Rocky ended up having me and so this is what he got me. He got me an LA Dodgers hat for when we play softball. Pretty nice, look at that, ooh, ooh, yeah, yeah. And to go with that, he got me a Dodgers jersey, baby. Oh, yes, look at that, boom, and it has the World Series patch on it, which I think is sick. So I'm super excited to wear this for the next game. I got the jersey with the matching hat. I'm gonna look good. He also got me this sweet art piece that is uh, <laughs> Star Wars. Okay, so we have like a shared notes for our phones and we all kind of put like suggestions on what we were wanting and stuff. And I put pink Star Wars painting, cool AF, like has to be sick. And I would say this is pretty sick. It's super hip. And we got Han and Leia right here, looking good, walking into the distance. So now I just gotta frame it and it's gonna go in that room over there. I'm so excited. Those walls are completely bare. I recently painted it all myself, which was really fun. And so I need like some artwork to go up. And now I got this one, first piece, yay. That's what Rocky got me. Super exciting. Next, we did another Secret Santa with four families. My whole family, my cousin's whole family, the D. St. George's, and then the Hudson's and the Loffers, our two really, really, really close family friends. So for that one, Gator had me. It was so cute. He picked all this out himself. It's awesome Yeti cup. And if you don't know what Yeti is, it's like super, super great quality. Um, they have like coolers and stuff. Riker got a Yeti cooler. He's obsessed with it. And it just keeps the temperature of everything like if you put ice in this the ice will stay there for like a couple days I swear so cute I can put my tea in it and I love this color and then he got me a Chipotle and an uber gift card I love Chipotle I go there a lot and I use uber a lot so these are gonna be super handy gators my cousin by the way if you didn't know my favorite thing that he got me he got me baseball gloves <laughs> I'm so, so stoked about these. I used them for the first time this morning, actually. And they're black with pink all over them. He did perfect. These are good. Rocky and Gator, both my secret Santas. Nailed it. I got a lot of baseball related stuff this year, which I'm totally cool with. The last baseball related thing that I'm gonna show you is from my mom. If you didn't watch my last IGTV vlog, you should go watch that, it's super awesome. All the moms got the four families matching jerseys for when we play. So mine says Lynch, I asked for 25. I'm 25 right now. I was like, yeah, why not? We got two jerseys, so I got the black one and the pinstripe one, which I love so much. And the pinstripe one is Team California, and the black one is Team Hollywood. Now all I need is pants and socks, and then I really have the full baseball get up going. A couple things that I bought myself, tweet yourself, is uh, I bought myself a new muscle roller. <laughs> and of course it's pink. Look how cute this is. Is this not the best pink you've ever seen in your life? So the last roller I had was getting super dull and it was this ugly green color. So I needed this. If you don't know what this is, it's uh, to roll out your muscles and it's really good for you. I try to do it every day. That doesn't happen, but my goal is to do it like twice every day because my muscles are super tight all the time and it's really good for you. Other thing that I bought myself was a super, super cute purse from Topshop. We were at the Grove or the Americana. I'm vibing this for like New Year's or we're gonna go to Vegas. This is gonna look so cute in Vegas. So I got that. And I don't usually buy stuff for myself, but I was like, I gotta get this. So cute. This was sent to me from a friend in Florida that owns her own hair salon. Her name is Sophia. And this, look at this straightener. This is so cool. And it's AB rhinestones, which I love. So it's super iridescent, opalescent, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, it's a really nice straightener. So I'm excited about that. Blang, blang. I also bought myself some lotions from Bath and Body Works and candles. Uh, the, I didn't bring the candles over here, but they pretty much match these. I should have bought these like in November so that I could use them all month. 
but I was a little late to the game, that's okay. So I got Twisted Peppermint Lotion, Hot Cocoa and Cream Lotion. This smells so good, it smells like chocolate. Frosted Coconut Snowball and Spiced Gingerbread Swirl. This one smells like chai tea, which I love. Twisted Peppermint Candle, Hot Cocoa and Cream Candle, and one other one that's not a lotion. Um, oh, I got like a van vanilla ginger. I actually it might be this one, the spiced gingerbread squirrel. I don't know. They smell so good. I love candles. Oh, let me just sh turn around here and show you some of this stuff. I love my tree. It's so pink and happy. <laughs> my mom got me these. Look how cute this is. Boop, 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 boop. Oh my gosh. I love them. She also got me this cupcake one. Oh, for like stocking stuffers, my mom got me some jewelry, some cool necklaces and earrings. And of course, we cannot have a Christmas without matching jammies. So my mom got us all matching jammies. It was so cute. You can check my Instagram if you wanna see the pictures. We even matched the dogs. Oh, last thing I bought myself I really, really wanted it. I got myself a pair of Sonos speakers, the white ones. And they aren't here yet. They're actually being delivered today. So I'm just eagerly waiting for my doorbell to ring so I can set them up. It was our first California Christmas, which was weird. It was still amazing and still fun, but it, it didn't like feel like Christmas because I'm used to snow and mountains and stuff. So it kind of just felt different, but still good. I'm gonna go check. Okay, it's not here, but I also forgot. My mom got me these three new faux fur coats. I have quite the faux fur jacket collection now. It's just getting larger and larger, and I can't get rid of any because they're all so amazing and timeless. This is a super pretty burgundy, fluffy type one. I'll be wearing these on my Instagram for sure for the next couple days. This amazing royal blue. Look at this blue. This one is kind of on the shorter side and then this other blue one I don't know what kind of color blue you would call this, but it's really nice and this one's pretty long Which is cool. Those are from my mommy and then where's my phone? Okay Story time real quick. I haven't updated you guys on this yet. I went to Six Flags Oh, that's another thing I bought for my Christmas present to me a season pass to Six Flags Which I'm super excited about but anyways, bought my season pass to Six Flags and I went and uh, funny enough, I was wearing one of my Rydell jackets from my clothing store, the one with the smiley face on the back. And I had my phone in my inside jacket pocket like the whole day and it never came out once. We're on Goliath, I'm in the back seat and someone's glasses from, you know, somewhere in the front fly off and they're floating towards me. It felt like... I was in space, so it was floating towards me and I reach up to catch him. I'm like, I'm gonna be a baller and catch this guy's glasses. So as I go up to catch him, my phone is in my inside jacket pocket, jean jacket, floats up slowly, 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 my bright red Mophie case. And I just so I just see this floating red thing. And I'm like, no. I try to grab it and then zoo, it drops on the floor. <laughs> oh, I got to sneeze all of a sudden. So I lost my phone. <laughs> it was really sad. And the only thing that's sad is I didn't have it backed up for like the last seven months. So I'm missing seven months of pictures. So depressing. So, I mean, fingers crossed they still might find it, but it's not looking very good. Assuming they pretty much wouldn't find it right after I left Six Flags I went straight to the Apple store and bought a new phone So this we can count as a Christmas gift to myself as well. It's the iPhone XS I got the smaller one because it's Sort of the same size as my last one. The last one I had was a 7 plus. I usually get a new phone every What is that four years three four years or so and I set it up and Yeah, still haven't found the last one that fell off a like 100 foot roller coaster, however high. It's definitely probably shattered into a million pieces because we were so high up and Goliath is a super intense roller coaster. And uh, the find my iPhone thing is off and it's always on. So that's what makes me think it's just destroyed. 
<laughs> so yeah, that's the end of my story. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, I hope you had such a great holiday with all your family and friends. I love you guys so much. Happy New Year. I hope 2019 is amazing for you, which it will be. Put it out into the universe. 2019 is gonna be amazing, 2K19. All right, I'll see you guys later. I'm gonna go pack for Vegas and wait for my Sonos. Hee. <laughs>